having lots of money does not guarantee you will live well. So we have a nice expensive house, big garage, game room, terrace with mountain views, huge living space, but this is the problem. Can you see what's wrong? Let me tell you. This bedroom is miserable, there is no window, you need to walk past the bed to get to the bathroom, the pantry is in the middle of nowhere, detached from the kitchen, which blocks the view, and the dining and living spaces are separated by the noisy kitchen making entertaining awkward. You need to walk around the living room to get to the powder room, and the couch cannot see the views. So let's fix it! Using cutouts so you know I'm not cheating, I'll move the rooms around. Kitchen to the back, living and dining spaces next to each other by the views. Pantry next to the kitchen as it should. Powder room next to the lift as it should. The bedroom will go next to the terrace and we have lots of new space for the ensuite. This is how it looks drawn out properly. So with the famous tiny furniture in place, you can tell even though the living and dining rooms are about the same size, they feel so much bigger together and we now have this continuous spacious room all enjoying those nice mountain views. The kitchen and dining rooms both have access to the terrace and that awful bedroom is now huge with a proper ensuite. Here's the before and with the same square footage we have made this house 10 times better so now you know